Hi friends, welcome to my channel. In this video, we are going to discuss the basic part of Java, a programming language. Okay, so the first video is will describe the concept of data types and variables. So think of your computer's memory as a big shelf. Okay, so and variables as labeled boxes on that shelf. Each box stores a certain kind of data like a number, a letter, a word, or just true or false. So Java is a statically typed language, which means we have to declare what kind of data goes into each box. So let's look at the most common types that we will use in Java. Data types, int, double, char, boolean, string. These are the data types we will use commonly in our language, Java language. Okay, int, okay, int will store like uh, whole numbers, double will store decimal numbers, char will store single character, boolean will store true or false, and the string will store the text. So how we have to store the value? Like for int, we can direct the number, the whole numbers, and for double, decimal numbers like 0 0.9 and like that we have to write. In char, we have to write the word in the single grid, like single letter, I mean single quotes, sorry, single quotes. In that, we have will store a letter, and for boolean, we'll store true or false, and for string, We'll store in double quotes. Whatever we want to write, we can write in the double quotes. So if you compare with the real life, right? So int we may, we typically use for storing the A's like that. And for double price of a product. And for care, it is you know like used for grading school. And in for boolean is light on. And for string, your name or sentence. Okay, so let us write the program. So we have already written. So let me remove this first. Okay, see, this is normally nothing but a class called data type. Okay, and with a main method. Okay, so this is the class and this is the um, main method. So in that, I will write int. Int is a data type. Okay, what int will store? It will store the, see, int is a data type. How can we store values in the data type? For that, there is a standard format. Format. What is that int? Data, data type and we have to write the variable name like age is equal to something like 25 or 21 like that okay int age equal to 25 that means data type variable is equal to the value this is the standard form to declare a data type and to show the value in the given variable and string now i will write the all the different types of data type string name is equal to double quotes don't forget this is the standard form okay standard format and after that int string double double is used for mainly price like it will be in the decimal numbers right so 98.99 or percentage also we can say and double after that char like grade it is stored you need to store a grade a like what is the grade you have scored and at last boolean boolean uh, what is boolean uh, passed or not passed true or not okay done so what we have done till now we have uh, declared the common data types which are used how uh, how can we declare the data types okay so data type variable name is equal to the value okay this is the standard form so i have to print this now what i have to do i have to print this now so in java how can we print we will use system dot out dot print ln for printing in java in the console we will use this okay so what should we write in the console right we will be writing in the double quotes okay so it is the string double quotes is mainly for the string okay so your name is i will write name as to what, uh, where i have stored the value of name in the variable name right yes so similarly i will print for every data type five data types that your age is age and uh, price cost what is the cost or percentage i can say it. percentage percentage you scored 
so in actually in questions they will provide what data type also we have used if not given we will store accordingly we have to use the common sense there like for if they are uh, told to find the like price or percentage like that we will use this double so in the question they will use what type, what data type we have to use but if they are not giving that by seeing the question itself we need to know what data type we should declare okay so and uh, grade your grade is a and passed or not passed or not okay yeah what we are writing it is a class so actually we have not used grade and this is passed okay done okay so we in a written this is the class a class name data types and we in the main method we are to we are writing the different types of uh, variable and sorry data types different type of data types and we are storing it in the different variables and we are printing that okay just in the java program we are discussing about the data types and variables so here like this we can initiate uh, like we can start writing the data types and after that variable name and we can store the value and by using system.out.println we will be able to use the print okay so after that i will am giving a quick challenge like what data type would you use to store your height okay and also see what data type by seeing this you uh, first try this in your uh, like you are not having the eclipse or uh, spring tool suit you can try in the java online compiler just for your practice purpose so after running this program so try what should you have to try what which data type would you use to store your height okay let me know in the comments okay and after that uh, in the next video we are going to discuss operators in java also in the beginning you will you will be making some mistakes right so what are the common mistakes like every beginner do like i have also done in my beginning what are the the char is there right character should be stored in the single quotes okay should be must be in the single quotes okay and the string should be in the double quotes so and also java is just case sensitive so see while declaring uh, int while declaring int i am using the i am starting with the small word okay and for a string i am using the capital word capital letter first similarly for double char boolean i am using the small letter first so similarly it is a case sensitive it is a standard one while declaring any data type remember this okay for string we are using capital letter and for uh, other data types we are using small letter and also boolean must be lower case like true or false okay not capital t see if i write capital t see will it work it is showing the error right see for the error also i will show true cannot be resolved to a variable okay true so also try one try creating a so it's a small homework for you try creating a java program that stores your name age and favorite programming language and prints it okay so what you need to try you need to try a java you need to write a java program that stores your name okay you should have to declare your name and age and a favorite java programming language see i haven't given you the types which data type i have to, we have to use so make the program and the run so if it is successfully done you can comment with yes we have done or else if you have any doubts which data type we have to use for name age and favorite like to store java programming language right so if you have any doubts you can comment in the comment section so thank you guys for watching my video